Welcome to the Simpler Business Podcast, where we talk about ways to do what you love and serve your people in a way that brings you income and freedom. I'm your host, Marissa Roberts. Join me as I chat with my favorite entrepreneurs about how they simplify their biz so that you can simplify yours. When you're an entrepreneur or a small business owner, it's easy to fall into the trap of thinking that perfection is the key to success. But the reality is mistakes are an inevitable part of your journey. The true measure of your success lies not in avoiding the errors, but more in how you respond to and how you learn from them. Whether you're working on your business or serving your clients, from time to time, things will go a little pear-shaped. Just this week, I sent out an email for a client promoting a webinar that had the wrong date and time, and I still didn't catch the error until my client flagged it, which was mortifying for me because I take a lot of pride in delivering really good quality work. But she's an amazing client and a wonderful person and was so gracious about it. She knew it was an error not a reflection of me as a person and a service provider. And in her own words, we're all human. That made me feel a lot better. Mistakes are learning opportunities. Every mistake is really a lesson. When things don't go as planned, it gives you valuable insights into what's working and what needs changing. It's these experiences that help you refine your strategies, improve your processes, and ultimately make better decisions in the future. Facing and overcoming mistakes builds resilience. It teaches you to adapt, pivot, and persevere in the face of a challenge. Resilience is really important for long-term success, and the entrepreneurial journey, there are plenty of obstacles and uncertainties, so it's more about getting comfortable with the fact that it's going to happen. Having a growth mindset really comes into play in the tricky times. Shift your focus from fearing failure to valuing continuous learning and continuous improvement. When you view mistakes as opportunities for growth, that's when you encourage more innovation and more creativity. And you tend to get more comfortable trying new ideas when you know that mistakes don't mean the end of the world. They're just part of the learning process. Mistakes can also help you with your problem-solving skills because they often highlight any underlying issues within your business. By addressing a problem, you improve your own skills and enhance your business operations, preventing similar mistakes in the future and strengthening your overall business strategy. Transparency is a good thing as a business owner. Admitting and discussing any mistakes that you make openly creates a culture of transparency and trust within your business and your clients and your team. When we acknowledge our own mistakes, it sets a positive example for everyone else and encourages them to do the same. And when customers see that you are honest about your errors and committed to fixing them, they're more likely to trust and stay loyal to your brand. The key to turning mistakes into positives lies in your response. So here are a few practical steps to help you navigate and learn from any mistakes that you might be making. Step one is to acknowledge the mistake. It's better to admit when something's gone wrong because denial or deflection only decreases trust. Step two is to analyze the situation, understand what led to the mistake, identify the root cause and the factors that contributed to the error. Step three is to develop a plan create a strategy to address the mistake and prevent it from happening again. And this might involve process changes, additional training, new tools, new resources. Step four is to take action. This is when you implement your plan promptly. Communicate clearly with your team or with your client and make sure everyone's aware of the new approach. And step five is to reflect and learn. After addressing the mistake, take a moment to reflect on the experience. What did you learn? How can you apply these lessons to future challenges? Mistakes aren't the end of the road for your business, no matter how big they are. So just embrace them and learn from them and then use them to move your business forward. You can overcome challenges and inspire innovation and continuous improvement. You can't avoid every mistake, but you can fix them when they happen and learn from them and be a great role model to others and build trust and loyalty with your clients and your team. 
I hope you found this episode useful. If you'd like to chat more about it, you can come and find me on Instagram. I'll leave a link in the show notes for you and I'll see you in the next episode. I hope you enjoyed this episode of the Simpler Business Podcast. If you did, please subscribe, rate and review us on Apple Podcasts. There's a link in the show notes to make it nice and easy for you, just the way we like it. If you're ready to simplify and scale your business, you can get started with my free audio class at marissaroberts.com. See you next time.